Hello everybody, Kevin here. Raf Dinner94. Welcome back to the channel. And is today, as you can see, we are finally coming back to Commander Conquer Generals. It has been probably almost a year now since we have last played anything that is related to Commander Conquer Generals and uh uh, the reason I have come back is one, I kind of want to come back and play in the game again. Two, I have to find out the easiest way to install multiple mods without, you know, making a backup photo, uh, photo of the main game. And that is going to be the usage of G uh, General Launcher. Now, if you don't know about this application, it pretty much allows you to install multiple uh, multiple mods without altering the, the, the original game files. Uh, hash uh, aka vanilla file so uh, and, uh, and also it makes it much much easier in like uh, you know on the choice that you, uh, on the mods you want to you know that you want to play in one launcher and like I said before it does not alter the game files in in any way so this is probably this is probably the safest and probably the best way to play commander conquer journals with mods uh, I might even make a, uh, a video on how to install mods uh, uh, using that launcher because it is really, really easy. And honestly, I, I don't know why I didn't even use it when it, when it came out uh, last year. Uh, I heard about it, but you know, I just didn't really get the time then checking out the general launcher. But yeah, highly recommend you guys use that application. Uh, if you want to play multiple mods for Command and Conquer Generals, and uh, and most of the popular mods are in the list as well, so you don't have you should have no problem finding Shockwave, Rise of the West, and as well as the End of Days, which we're all going to be continuing our playthrough. Uh, I think last we left out, we showcased uh, one of the Russian sub factions. So in this one, we're going to go back to USA. I think there might be one more sub faction to cover. Uh, for the US, uh, uh, so I think it's Marine Corps, I believe. So we're gonna sh uh, give that a shot. And this mod also received a significant up uh, update uh, since I last played it. So we're at 0 0.98 right now. And the last version I played was 0 po uh, 0.97.1. Uh, so, and apparently there's a lot of balance changes, a lot of fixes, a lot of model improvements, uh, potential balance uh, changes as well. So, uh, we'll see how this goes. Uh, we're going to just uh, go right into the game and we'll see what happens. Uh, it's been a long time, so I, I don't know if I'm going to be able to beat a medium AI. I might get my ass handed down, but it depends how the AI plays in this mod. I And I totally forgot how to play, so... Uh, we're just gonna go in blindly and hope for the best that we do the best we can. Uh, excuse me, in winning the game. So, all right, let's get this started. What's the story? All right, let's get a move on. on. The job. All right, so like I said, it's been a while since I played in the game, and before we do anything, I'm gonna lower the sound effects just a little bit because it is pretty, uh, pretty loud. Uh, voice, not so much. Uh, but yeah, like I say, it's been a w long time since we played Commander Conquer Jails, and like I say, I absolutely miss playing I'll this game. Anyway. Uh, definitely uh, one of my childhood games uh, that I played when I was a kid. Uh, what the hell is going on that build space right there? Bring on the scaffold construction. So yeah, like I said, I've been wanting to play this game for a long time. It's just a matter of when, so now we're actually into the game now. Um, it feels good to be back. And uh, this is a fairly, fairly small projects? map as Finish. well, so... Yeah. Sounds good. On the job. New construction. This one is definitely going to be more on the infantry Bring side the here. Scaffolding. Okay, yeah, I am a little yeah. bit lagging behind, so we got to definitely pick up the haze the here. Clocked in. Build up the, the little Bring power plants the here. To make some improvements. Okay, get the supplies Throw here. Yeah, we should be okay for now. Got to build some oh, rocket finished. troops. Uh, so that way we can build our little fire base here. Construction. Like I said, I don't know how intense the AI is going to be. So we just hope for the best to go a little bit easy on me. Probably shouldn't build close to that train track, by the way. Everything is going to get absolutely messed up. So we got the ADAS missile system here. So I don't know how you select your factions. There. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, unfortunately, we can't pause the game, so we just got to roll with it. Let me launch one. Okay. 
What's the story? We're good here. Can't build a strategy center. We need more money. And right now we are absolutely broke right now. Always ready. Definitely gotta put some protection on this side here. Do not want them to hit me on this side here. Okay, we do. We got some infantry we're moving up. We got some tanks. Okay. I'm gonna lose my dozer. Okay, we might we might actually need uh we might need all missiles here. Okay, okay here's the downside. Can't really attack. Uh okay, so this is pretty cool. So we can uh upgrade our firebase with our artillery gun or a phalanx, looks like, to take down enemy aircraft. Uh, I'm not sure that was in the original mod uh, last I played, the last update, so this must be new. I do notice the new uh, uh, symbol too for the USA, which looks pretty fantastic, by the way. And I'm thinking they don't have the the sub-faction anymore, like the Yusuf, so now all the, the sub-faction is now part of the, the general powers now, so that's going to be pretty interesting. There we go. Okay, definitely gonna put the artillery cannon here. Gonna put another one here for air defense. Cause I friend, we are gonna need that. Let's put one right here. Plus nothing but stinger guys here. I'm gonna build the strategy center over here. Let's see, infantry grenades, equip ranger marines with grenade launchers. Okay. Okay. Not sure what the hell they're doing. For the phalanx system. There's some phalanx. Okay, we are running on really, really low on power. Let's upgrade it. Okay. So I think we're looking okay. What the hell are you doing back here? Okay. So I decided to just, uh, let them pass by, I guess. That's not cool. Let me catch you star. Alright. Get right. this guy's in here. Any yeah, then it's gonna put nothing but rocket guys in there. Cause looks like they're sending a lot of tanks. New construction. I'm gonna have to send this dozer here to get repaired. Yeah, definitely a good call. Okay, upgrade that artillery gun. Okay, now it should provide a little bit of extra firepower now. Now that we got the little... Have a job uh, artillery cannon on it. Scaffolding. Okay, so this is where. Okay, I forgot now. So this is where you get to choose your sub factions. Okay, got it. Okay, so uh, so we already did air force and special forces. So the only thing we haven't done is marine corps. So so it looks like marine corps specializes in advanced land units, uh, and uh, we have access to the Abrams, uh, the Bradley, the M109 Paladin howitzers, the M270 uh, multiple launch rocket system, F-18 Hornet, AGM-129 launcher, and NLOS uh, LS, and a Minuteman silo, which is the nuke. Uh, and it also gets some special perks as well. Our uh, long range artillery shoots 50% faster. We get Reaper Attack Drone, a helicopter, attack helicopters do 10% more damage. And uh, long range artillery also armed with ATAX MS. I'm not sure what that is specifically, so I'm gonna have to look that up. Abrams, Bradley, and Paladin gain venerancy twice as fast. and. All vehicles are move faster and more health by 15%. So yeah, this is definitely more under uh, infantry and tanks wise. And we are gonna check out Marine Corps because we're ready, we're ready to check out Special Forces and Air Force. So we're going Marine Corps all the way. Ooh, uh. Gotta make some improvements. All right. Let's build. Let's see, I'm then I'm gonna put I'm gonna put another I'm gonna put another oh, rocket yeah. right here. Yeah. We can upgrade our war factories to build more advanced units. I like that. Okay, I'm gonna build our airfield here. Alright, uh, put our detention center. Okay. Okay, good thing. Yeah, this time they did not make it through. And look at that, all infantry has switched up a little bit too as well. So we don't have the winch anymore. Now we got marines now. Not sure what the hell that repair vehicle is doing. Yeah, 
I'll build any Yeah, I'm gonna build another one. See, I, I don't think I have to worry about the trains coming through, so I am gonna take a risk here. Put the uh, little H attack, uh, the fence system right there. Yeah. Looking good, looking good. We oh. definitely want to leave some gaps so our tanks can get through. So we don't want to cram everything too much there. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna build probably another war factory right here. Bring on the scaffolding. This should be okay. And probably build like a another little fire base right here for the Fenlex. So to start sending helicopters. Let's see how the AIs are feeling. Okay, so they look all white. Uh, they're not really expanding as much, so. So I'm not sure what's going on there. Okay, now we can get such an destroyer plan. So now we have a little bit extra range now. Uh, we definitely gotta build some supply drop zone because we are low on money right now. So it's time to get that. Ooh, 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 ooh. Almost lost that. So it looks up. Like we can get a. Uh, then you can put the javelin trips in there. You have been promoted. Okay, we're doing pretty good so far. Let's go get some marines here, so that way we get a little bit of infantry, uh, infantry protection. Looking pretty good here. All the fences. Uh, I'm going to build another. I'm going to build another airfield. I think if I have the space. It's gonna be a little bit tight, but we're doing it. We're doing it. Let's build. Uh, we definitely need to build more power. So let's build some more power reactors. Uh, and then more money as well, because we're gonna need it. Put some power plants right here. So Mark 46 machine gun, or we're gonna launch it. Let's have one. Oh, we're gonna launch it. Let's see how the Marines look in this game, because I think the models here are a little bit different as well. Uh, they definitely look like Marines. Uh, looks more like you know Marsock or Army Rangers, but you know, it is what it is. They look pretty cool regardless. Yeah, I'm gonna put an air defense system right here. So it decided to send any uh, air, like I said, it'll be fucked. Okay, what is this upgrade here? Build a cannon, build a cannon on this true caller. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Uh, I'm not sure what I'm doing. Hopefully this doesn't, hold up, hold up. Okay, it puts a little cannon on top. So that, okay, I think we do want that actually. So this will, get, this will make it even more useful. Let's take a look at the upgrade. Okay, Wanna interesting. Make some so now it should be a little bit more protection now. Uh, should give a little bit more infantry protection with the little with the little 50 cal gun on it. This will, like I said, this will make it a whole lot New more effective. Made in the Get some more power made. build. Lay in the foundation. Alright. Good area. This is solely ever build the supply the drop zone because, like I said, this is not going to last so long. Wow, look at this. So we it can stand, so we have the ability to extend supply drops, looks like, which is pretty insane. Now let's see what we got here for our general. Congratulations, Wow, they did not they did not like <laughs> They did not like that. Alright, let's get some uh uh, uh, let's definitely get some uh, more anti-air capabilities. Uh, then we're gonna build some F-18 Hornet as well. Yeah, I kind of figured. Okay, yeah. So this is where this is where we're a little bit. Okay. Okay. This we're gonna have to. So everything's falling down already. Everything's falling apart. Not good, not good, people. Not good, not good. Okay, so this is what I was really, this is what I was really afraid of. So we definitely took a huge hit right there. 
Okay, uh, let's build some more rocket guys. Make some improvements? Uh, definitely got a weird build on the fences here. Okay, all the fences take them out. Definitely gonna lose that. Okay, like I said, things are getting a little bit spicy now. Yeah, we definitely gotta build some vipers just to be on the safe side. Because we're definitely gonna definitely can't let that happen again. Nope, I don't think so. Okay. Okay, things are getting a little bit heavy now. Not sure what the hell are you doing. Okay, let's get the attack choppers. Let's take this out, shall we? Okay, get that out. Yeah, yeah, I like to see it's not really these things are not really that effective now. Okay, so now we really gotta stop building our military forces now. Okay, luckily there is no uh, luckily we got no uh no artillery at the moment or any anti air. So what I'm gonna do, I am gonna build uh Definitely gotta build some uh, uh, anti-air units for sure, cause that shit absolutely messed me up. Yeah, those are those are extremely devastating. Yeah, okay, gotta build another one right here. Okay, so I'm a little bit a uh, little bit focused here. Okay, so let's see what upgrade we should get. Whoa! Okay. Okay, get rid of that. Okay, we should be good. Alright. There we go, excellent. They're not even standing a chance. Air okay, I'm, I'm gonna I'm then gonna build some more of the MDATs. Gonna build more rocket troops. Congratulations, General. Okay, things are getting a little bit spicy. Things are getting a little bit spicy here. Then we actually did lost our dozer, so let's build another one. Yeah. Um not sure I can cram another airfield here. So the best thing we can do is probably build some more. Let's build. Build some more of this. Our base is being attacked. How do I repair that? Okay. Really, that so went through, sir. Are you kidding me? Okay, they're being a little bit bold now. They're being a little bit more aggressive now, which is, you know, I like, you know, you know, keeps things a lot more interesting to say the least. Standing by for orders, sir. Uh, but yeah, we definitely gotta build some more anti-air here. Some more, just some more assholes here. Oh, uh oh, we gotta take that out. Gotta take that out. Yeah, we keep losing dozers here, which I don't like. Okay, we got a huge blob coming toys here. You know what? I'm then gonna build another uh, fire base right here. Because uh, sometimes they'll be bridging due to lines. Gonna build another rocket right here. Okay. So now we need to focus on uh, what we need to do right now. Uh, we definitely need to build up our uh, military forces. Uh, I'm probably gonna get the. Uh, the Minuteman Research Program, so we can build nukes. Because I think we're gonna get some nukes. Can't build the air rooms yet. I uh, think we need to do armor division. We need to get that. Special forces might be pretty cool to have as well. B21 nuke armor upgrade. That sounds pretty cool. There we go. There we go. Now they're definitely not gonna. They're definitely not gonna be. Uh, oh, we could get some dad as well. Can also do that. Few air bombs. Let's get that. Spectre gunship. Uh, A10 strike. I do like that. Let's get that. 
Oh. Oh my god. There's fucking artillery here. Destroy it. Almost blew it up. Get some more stingers. Keep blowing my fucking dozer up, which I did not like. Okay, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I got another one coming. Streak ready for combat. Let's pop some tanks. Yeah. There we go. Looking good. All right, let's check out if they have another supply right here. They have not, which is very, very surprising. Uh, being a being a Minuteman solo right here. We're gonna get all the upgrades here. It's gonna be a little bit pricey, but I'm thinking it's gonna be worth in the long run. Let's also get countermeasures too, so our planes will get some. Uh, they get a little bit more countermeasures, a little bit more protections. Okay, we can build infinite drones. That's pretty cool. Build some A tens. Boy, they, they are being really, really aggressive. Being really aggressive here. Okay, I think we're gonna have to start attacking because they are again. Like I said, they are getting a little bit more aggressive. Uh, doesn't seem like they got any uh, that much protection, so. Uh, what we're gonna do is upgrade our ATM missile strike. I forgot to upgrade that. Okay, so we got. Uh, let's get some more upgrades here, so that way our guys will be a little bit more stronger. All right, we definitely gotta stop building our military forces here. Wanna make some See, the only good way we can attack is a direct head-on. We could try to attack him from the city, but that's also going to be a little bit risky as well. Man, that's fucking crazy. All right, I'm going to stop building our Abrams. We're going to stop building our military forces up because I think it's because I think it is time. It is time to hit them. Hit them with everything we got. We could build some Reaper drones too. Not sure how effective they're gonna be. Okay, let's check this out. Check that out. Okay, looking pretty good. So you can't really build javelins yet. See so Tomahawk Mr. Strike, absolutely. Okay. So it's pretty cool that you can upgrade the uh, levels uh, over time. They do cost a lot of money, but you know, everything costs upgrade money in this game. <laughs> Good area. All right, so I'm thinking. I'm thinking. So this is all what they got. Looks like. So it looks like they got a fo uh, a flanker. They got a fog for it as well. Not sure how to burn so many planes all at once, but looks like this is all the base they have at the moment. We could hit them with the nuke. Which I'm thinking I might consider doing that. Uh, but right now, let's build up our helicopter fleet. Let's see, Black Hawks can arm the Black Hawk with 18 missile infantry fire points. Nice. Now let's take a look how this Abram is looking in this game. Looking pretty slick, to say the least. Uh, pretty much your standard Abrams, uh, but with a fresh, uh, with a fresh coat of paint, looks like. We could give us some uh, scout sensor to extend the unit, unit sight win. We we'll definitely be okay. We need to go. We need to destroy this thing. God, man, those do so much freaking damage. They do so much damage. Oh, it should be good though. You know what? I'm gonna hit the new. Uh, I'm gonna hit the airfield with the nuke because I'm. I'm kind of tired of that bullshit. Star streak ready for combat. Let's continue to upgrade our stuff as Unit well. Lost. There we go. We took out the damn airfield. So that's one last problem to deal with. Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to hit. The power plants. Okay, Dinamite has hit us with something. Now I'm gonna build some more MDATs. I think we gotta start hitting the command center because uh, because that might be getting some more general powers along the way. 
See, have we got the fear air bomb upgrade? I think we did already, so I'm thinking we can drop the fear Unit air bomb lost. right here. Moving to new AO. All weapons primed and ready. Pretty good. Okay, let's build some paladin tanks as well. Uh, our artillery. You need something wiped out. Unit oh boy, oh boy. That's how you do it, baby. Okay. Gotta take this out. Edit's battery reporting. Unit lost. You're about to be thunderstruck. Woo! Edit's battery There we go, baby. Okay, pretty cool stuff. Okay, so we're looking pretty good so far here. Uh, looks like we're still loving up, so. Uh, let's get the emergency repair, and we're gonna get long range missile system. Uh, I have a feeling. Spare some Bradley as well. The next one we're gonna get is special forces. That are all infantry will be veterans, and we're getting the javelin troops as well. So all this stuff we can get because we had to be air force or special forces. Uh, but yeah, you can definitely, uh, I can definitely see a lot. Of, I can definitely see a lot of big changes here. You fucking little bitches. Jesus Christ, these things are overpowered. Extremely overpowered these things. Uh, looking pretty good though. I'm gonna. So it looks like you're going to build one dad. Looks like requires a mobile ne uh, wait on it nearby. Okay, so we gotta build a mobile. Oh my god! Fucking hate this artillery here. Absolutely annoying to do it. Okay, looking pretty good. Looks like they just rebuild everything. Hit this shit with the nuke here. Yeah. Gotta hit this with the missile here. There we go, baby. They're all getting more upgrades, so we gotta be a little bit careful. Woo, that was close. They almost sent something my way, so they are getting more powers here, which is not looking good now. In here, HBM launcher, not looking good at all here. Yeah, they're getting more advanced here. We're getting a lot more advanced here. All right, we're gonna okay. At this way, we're gonna have to stop beginning our attack here because things are getting a little bit spicy. A little bit too spicy for my liking. See, now everybody's kind of getting stuck now, which is not what I want. What the hell are you hiding over here, huh? So we gotta get our units here. Let's okay, see what's going on here. Understood. There we go, boy. Sir, yes, sir. There we go. There we go, baby. We're going in. We're going in, everybody. Unit lost. This is Angel. Daisy Cutter Prime and on the way. Okay, things are getting a little bit spicy now, people. It's fucking game on. It's game on. I say things are getting a little bit intense here. Woo -wee! That's so we true, bitch. There we go. Looking pretty good. He won't be a problem for much longer. Unit lost. 
Oh wow, that fucking hit. Okay, we gotta go in. We have to go in, everybody. Gotta go in. Woo wee! It's not all nothing now. Okay, luckily, they don't got too many things left. Holy Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Things are getting tense. We gotta push, we gotta push. We gotta push in now. Things are not looking good for us. Jesus Christ. This is fucking brutal. Okay, gotta blow that up. Blow this up. Come on, come on. Come on. Blow up the fucking command center. At least do that, at least. At least do that, people. Come on. There we go. Really, really. Really got them. Jesus Christ. Now uh, that was fucking brutal right there, everybody. Holy shit. Jesus Christ. Now that was fucking goddamn gruesome. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay, we definitely gotta rebuild our military forces. Uh, definitely gotta build some more Abrams. Yeah. So this is like only on the medium AI too. Like, I really, really survived that. Jesus Christ, that was brutal, everybody. Let me blow that up. Give them something to think about. Listen to the engines hurting. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. Sir, yes, sir. How fucking Unit intense lost. is that? CIA intelligence Protecting ready. Our people. Heavy arm confirmed. Preserving freedom. Loaded with U.S. quality. Uh, it's time resources. to get some money from that. Something for Blades everyone. Motion. Okay, like I said, that was just intense. We barely survived that, but luckily with enough firepower, we managed to um, lost. make a huge breakthrough. Give them something to think about. I'm not sure what, what is this, what is this Abrams break. doing. Alright, let's get some F-18 Hornets. We're gonna take down this freaking plane right here. Copy. Take out this freaking uh, TU-22 out. Woo! See ya! Air there we go, we're sir, good. Yes, sir. On the green, but holy shit, man. We lost a lot of freaking units there. But that's pretty cool. This, I did not know. You can actually right mount away, infantry sir. into this sir, Abrams. Yes, so that sir, probably yes, makes them sir. a whole lot more effective uh, against infantry rather than using the main tank. Oscar so Mike. that is pretty right cool away, to sir. know. Let's do this. Uh, can do the same with the, the Paladin tanks here. So it's pretty cool. We can also use the standard HE or we can use the uh, GPS Goddess Shell, the Excalibur as well. Uh, I'm not sure how effective they are though. Uh, I'm pretty sure it just locks on into the target. That's just my guess. Oh my god. Uh, no one of the Bradleys were getting messed up so bad. They, I did not even upgrade them with the goddamn freaking Tome missile. No wonder they didn't do shit against freaking tanks. God damn it. Well, now to know one plans the U.S. in this mod, upgrade everything as much as you can because this game will not tell you what needs to be upgraded, what not, you know, what Every doesn't need to be upgraded. Oh, look at this. Look at this. We could have be flowing with cash right now, everybody. Sir, yes, sir. Moving to target location. We could have been We're flowing with cash. We can... So the moment we upgraded our center supply drop, we can now pretty much drop off any money, essentially, now. At our location, and the more we upgrade, the more money we get. So we get up to six thousand uh, dollars, nine thousand dollars in total at level three, which is absolutely fucking intense, uh, insane. Okay, okay, we have enough of this bullshit. 
Destroy this. Destroy that. Okay, we're, we're going all in, everybody. Right, let's go. Destroy that. There we go. There we go. So it looks like we only got a few couple buildings here, and that's pretty much done, so. Let's take a good look up the tanks uh, before we end Air this, though. So here's our here's our air defense uh, unit, looking pretty slick. Uh, it's pretty much a modified Bradley with uh, anti-air missile. Is there a threat? Got a nice looking paladin here, also based on the actual real life uh, counterpart, which is on an artillery rather than being a, a main battle tank like in Command and Conquer. And then we got the Bradley here as well. Bradley here looking absolutely beautiful. Marines don't really use Bradley, should be LV25, uh, LV25, but you know what, I'll let it slide. Alright, it's time to end the misery. Might as well take them out. Nothing much going on here. Might as well blow this shit up. But yeah, that was a little, that was pretty tough actually. Like, the AI was actually trying, you know, I thought, you know, uh, the AI would, you know, just sit around and you know, get stuck and can't build shit. Nope, I was completely wrong. You are victorious. So, yeah, luckily we did got a pretty good, decent battle there. Uh, like I said, I haven't played this game in a long time, so I was a little bit out of my mind. I was wondering, okay, what should I do? What should I do? And what should I do next? So, <laughs> so there we have it, guys. That is the U.S. Marine Corps showcase for the End of Days mod for Command & Conquer Generals. And uh, I think we, I think this is going to be the last sub faction we're going to be covering for the rest of the faction and so on. So, so I'm thinking this will probably be the last time we'll cover this mod until like a significant major update, you know, drops for this mod, where they add new units and uh, new general powers, etc. Uh, but I think the next, the next, fi the next showcase we're going to be doing, we're going to be doing the Chinese showcase. Uh, I need to look up which one I have, uh, I haven't covered yet. Uh, but so far, yeah, this mod definitely a uh, huge, uh, excuse me, a huge potential. I'm thinking the mod, the mod author is also planning on adding general, uh, general challenge. So, uh, but I think that's already in the mod already. So, uh, like I say, I'm gonna be definitely be keeping my eye on this mod as the, as update keeps progressing more for this because, like I say, huge potential. This mod could be the next big thing for this game. And it's actually one of the better newer mods too, because uh, uh, you know, Wise of the West and Shockwave, they are good mods. They have been, they have not been updated for so long. So, uh, like I said, it's, it's nice to see somebody's actually putting a lot of effort, you know, in making a mod. And uh, uh, the team uh, behind the end of the days uh, definitely, uh, definitely got a lot, a lot to show here. So. Uh, but on that, guys, that's going to be the end of the showcase for the Marine Corps. Stay tuned for the Chinese showcase. And if you, if you guys enjoyed the video, hit the like button. If you guys didn't, then hit the dislike button. It's up to you. And uh, if you guys want to see some more Commander Conquer or any other games you want to suggest for me to play, leave them in the comments down below and I will check them out. Uh, but yeah, guys, stay tuned for the next video. And until then, I will see you in the next one. Peace.